So I know it sounds weird, but hypervigilance does not like the absence of stress or a threat. And when it comes to childhood trauma, we grow up in a lot of stress, we grow up in a lot of threat, and our body is really programmed with hypervigilance to keep ourselves safe. It's like a protective part. But it doesn't like chill things. Here's what I mean in three ways. If, um, you're, if you're at work and things are actually going really well and that makes you uncomfortable, it's like a feeling of waiting for the other shoe to drop. Hypervigilance is looking for the threat and the stress is uncomfortable when it's not there. I know that sounds weird. Another one, a big one for me is not knowing how to do downtime or rest. I was really uncomfortable with a day off or a vacation because my hypervigilance didn't like the openness of that because maybe some childhood trauma feelings might come up. Another version is in your dating life. If you're sitting across from someone who is healthy and has it together, you might not know what to do with that person because hypervigilance is like, where's the drama? Where's the difficulty? I don't, I don't know what we're doing here. I need to keep you safe.